Walter Reed Weaver was born February 23, 1885 in Charleston, South Carolina and graduated from the United States Military Academy West Point as a second lieutenant in 1908. From 1927 to 1931, Weaver served as post commander of Maxwell Field. In March 1929, after torrential rains flooded parts of southern Alabama, Weaver, without hesitation or requesting permission, ordered the 22nd Observation Squadron to fly relief supplies and equipment to the victims of the flooding. Soon afterwards, the War Department confirmed Weaver's bold action by dispatching other aircraft to assist. In the five-day relief effort, 40 planes flew 281 missions for more than 600 hours. In 1939, he returned to Maxwell as the Commandant of the Air Corps Tactical School and Post Commander. In August 1940, after promotion to Brigadier General and with war clouds over Europe and the Far East, Weaver became commander of the newly established Southeast Air Corps Training Center, which by September 1945 oversaw over 100 flight schools in the Southeast and had graduated over 100,000 flight cadets, significantly contributing to the Allied victory by September 1945. Weaver represents the type of airman today's Air Force needs, someone who takes reasonable risks to get the mission done as General Weaver did in March 1929 in response to the flooding in southern Alabama. We can still view Weaver's boldness and decisiveness as Maxwell Air Force Base serves as a staging area for relief supplies and an evacuation center for victims of natural disasters throughout the Southeast United States. Today, we also embrace Weaver's enduring legacy as Air University transforms to capitalize on the opportunities current strategic environment affords us. To advance air power, thought and practice, enrich minds, strengthen relationships, and deliver solutions to emerging Air Force challenges. I'm A1C David Higgerson from AU A36M, and this has been your AU History Moment.